to another episode on Scratch, and today we are making the character of Electric 44. Uh, if you did not see the last episode, I would recommend you go check it out, because that's what we did all of this on, and it's decently interesting. Okay, so I have a model pulled up on a different computer, and I'm going to start, oh, that's a backpack with a lot of code in it. So I'm going to start with like a bright reddish. Let's get a triangle. No, I said that last time too. Not a triangle, a rectangle. Uh, so there's a very thin layer. Oops. I forgot we should probably zoom in. There's a layer of... Oh gosh. Actually, I'm going to zoom out for this. Let's start. There's a thin layer, third time it took me to say this, of red for his legs. Again, we have to go with the script and go 50. Just grab it. Looks like we're going to have to make it thin. So we're going to have to go like that, and we're going to have to push it together and then drag it over here and we're going to make it a little bit smaller that should be good okay now this is when we can zoom in okay then there's a layer of orange so let's get our rectangle Let's just go like that. Um, and then we need some yellow. Which we're going to go in from here. Go like that. And I'm not going to make it as detailed as his skin actually is. Because it's pretty detailed. This is not a good picture making thing. It's pretty good, but it's not one of the best, I would say. Okay, then we need like a dark blue. Just gonna do that to check it. Even darker than that. Maybe even that. Yeah, that looks good. Okay, now let's give him a body. Let's see how big that is. That's about his. That's about how big uh, Kanye Simmons is. Nope, messed up on that thing. Let's get the corner like that. There's more like magma type thing here, so I'm gonna give it some space to do that part, and we're gonna do the same thing on this, so we're gonna need another yellow, which we're gonna get, like, I'm gonna add a little yellow square there, then I'm gonna move that, I'm gonna zoom in even more, for this, because it's so small. Okay, now let's go in for a... Okay, and then we're going to need some orange. Actually, no. Let's take that out so we can get the orange. Because I don't want the it to be the arm to be too big add a thin layer of orange there another box of orange there then we need a red a thin layer of red perfect this is definitely the most detailed <laughs> out of both of them so far and i think this looks actually kind of cool Okay, so let's go for the same type of design. Boom, and let's get orange again. Let's fill in that. And that. Then we need a red. And have, and that's, oops, one second. And... 
that. That seems good. Now, great. The model just turned off. Uh, one second. I'm just gonna go do that. Turn it back on, and I'm gonna mute my mic quickly. Okay, we have the model back up, and I think we're basically done. We just need to work on the head. So let's add a square there. Seems big enough. And then we need another, like a darker yellow. Like, yeah, that actually is perfect. And then we need to add a, this there. That messed up. Uh-huh. Okay, perfect. By the way, electro Electric Killer 44 is a fire mage. So, that's why it's like magma-y. Okay, then he has red eyes and he has like no mouth, so. We just need to go like that and that. There is Electric Killer 44. Can't really see him. I might actually expand these guys like bigger. Eh, good enough, I guess. Now, I'm gonna have to name it Electric Killer 44. Go back, make a new sprite. I'm gonna go load up a another model of the next person, but first I'm gonna pause. And um, now we're doing TCP plays. Uh, I pulled up his model and made it so my computer that is showing the model doesn't go to sleep. Um, so yeah, basically his skin is a chicken. Sorry, my mic's being messed up too. By the way, I'm just moving my mic and headset around on my head. Um, yeah, he's a chicken. So yeah. So first off, we're gonna start by getting a box, and of course we're gonna have to go, and we're gonna have to give him a TP, there we go, now we're gonna have to make it smaller, costumes, okay, let's make it smaller, even a little bit smaller, okay, let's try that, yeah, perfect, Okay, now that we have that, we can zoom in. Okay, let's give it a... We're going to need to give it some legs. And so let's just do that. We're going to have to make that a little shorter on the top. And shorter. I'm looking at the other models when I'm doing this. Okay, yeah, that's good. And then we're going to need to take a bright yellow, get square, and we're going to have to go with the leg. And we're going to have to add legs to the chicken. So we're going to have to go like that. And at the bottom, there's a yellow stripe. Perfect. Actually, I'm going to add it, that there. Oops. There. Okay. Not looking good. I think I'm actually going to switch to black and make a... Make this yellow thin. Or thinner? Don't know if that's a word or not. So, just like that. Okay, now let's move on to the body, which is white. So you're going to have to go like this. Yep, good. And we're going to need to add some 
arms. So let's go down to there. It's a little hard to see. But that that looks good. And then we're going to have to take like this gold again or yeah, I guess it's gold. And we're going to have to make even though this is very detailed and you're probably not going to even see it. T C T C Oh, T. Looks like an F. No, get rid of that. Okay, let's go from here to here. T C Uh, nope. T C P and he does actually have some on his skin like I said I think I said said in my mind at least because <laughs> um well that's his username T C P and I'm actually going to take this and I'll move it over I'm going to take fill, uh, the to fill thing, and uh, just fill that in. There we go. You have TCP. And then we need to add, like, a black triangle. Is there a tool for that? Don't think so. Text, erase, select, remove background. Dang it. Okay. Select and do forget. No, thank you. I'm going to go like. Wait, no. Oops. I meant to do a rectangle. So, we're thin layer of black. Bam. Another thin layer of black. And another thin layer of black. I'm actually going to try using this tool to go like this. Then go like this. Ah, no, someone's calling me on Skype. Um, okay. This actually won't work. I'm going to have to draw one. Uh, I'll be right back. I have to go figure something out. I'm back. Uh, that was probably instant for you, but it's a few hours later for me. And uh, when I pause, we were working on TCP's head. And, uh, yeah. I'm going to get back to work on that. So... I am going to actually finish the side of his arm that I forgot to do. Come on. Sorry if there's background noise about, uh, don't know if it's going to be over this episode. It's a vacuum. Uh, let's add one more. Okay. Um, I'm actually going to bring this down a little bit. Two. There we go. Okay. Um, then we're going to need a red rectangle here. Then we're going to grab a yellow. Now, back. Okay, we're going to need a... Okay, that seems good. And then we're going to need... Uh, black triangles for his eyes. Perfect. This eye needs to be bigger. Okay, great. I'm going to name this one TCP Plays. Okay. So, we got the Minecraft players. Now, here, you know, I'm just going to stack these on top of each other for now. Okay, great. Actually, I want to do, I'm going to do a quick edit, because my skin does have a little black here, too, so. If I just fix that up. No. i keep it like my derpy is derpy, derpy skin. Okay. So, what to do next? 
I guess we can edit this because I'm actually I just got thought of an idea if I get a pur dark purple yeah this color let's add a nether portal here then get a brighter purple and add a that well wow, it's perfect those are some perfect colors okay I'm just gonna expand the portal a little bit no I liked it better just gotta undo okay fine let's get that oh gosh Great. Okay, now let's add a tiny bit more. Perfect. Okay. So we're going to enter the nether. And if I duplicate this, I'm going to get the select tool. And I'm going to have to delete all of this. And bam. Because I'm going to have to make the nether okay then let's delete this then delete that then these colors I can fill with white perfect and then now we have to design the nether Let's get like a dark red. For th actually, that looks more like nether brick. Okay. Let's get a brighter red, but not too bright. Actually, yeah, I'll just use a darker <laughs> red for it. For nether brick. If I even do nether brick. By the way, this is not ending soon. I'm going to add... A lot of stuff. Okay, there we go. Looking good. And then let's get a orange to go like this. Then get red, a darkish red again. Not spam. Okay, there. And then we're gonna have to go like that. That, that, and let's add a little rays here. Okay. And in the background, I'm going to add like a pink color. No, that doesn't look too good. Like a dark red, maybe? Yeah, that dark red looks good. gonna try and get these little edge pieces oh I did that on accident okay nope okay let's try this then try nope undo select tool and we'll go like this remove it get the fill and fill it in I still didn't get that and undo okay fine let's try selecting this again actually you know, let's get a thin line and that might actually work yep nope there good enough Okay, then what I'm also going to do is I'm going to duplicate this, and I'm going to get gray, so this is the next backdrop, and I'm going to make a square of there, across from there, so it's like a cobble path, I don't know why I did that, that was on accident, let's remove that grab the dark red get the fill bam okay 
Perfect. And then I would duplicate this again. But this time we're gonna remove this part. I can. Perfect. And then let's get a fill on the quick dark. And then the dark red. Okay, so it's just a flat. Sorry about that. Uh, let me cut out. Um, actually, yeah, that looks great. Let me undo that, though. I didn't mean to make it that big. That will be our nether brick. That's looking good. Then we'll make it look like it goes into the wall. Perfect. Okay. Now, uh, I'm gonna duplicate this one more time. Get another one. Then we're gonna have to make like a staircase up. Like this. Or that one was a little bigger. Of course, this isn't perfected. Okay, then I'm gonna do that. Duplicate that. And it's gonna make it so it goes to this. Okay, then duplicate that one, and go up like this, I'm actually going to expand this out, perfect, okay, okay, so they're on top of the nether fortress, And, um, now, next, we're gonna have to, we're gonna do a du another duplicate, duplicate, another duplicate, we're gonna go along and we're gonna remove this there, then we're gonna get the dark red, of course, and go fit and fill it in, gonna undo that, get the select tool out. Okay, and then get the fill back. Bam, bam. Okay, we got a fresh thing. Go for another dark. Then go back for a rectangle. So where would the fortress be? It would be there. So... It would be about here. I would say. No, not at all. I messed up. It would be about there. And you know what, what we can do is we can just go in with the select tool. Bam, bam. Get the fill. The dark-ish red. That is definitely not the color. Nor is that. There we go. That's the color. And then this. We're going to go back to the dark. Get a rectangle. And bam. So this will be a blaze spawner. So we're going to need to make a blaze. So let's get some blue out because we're going to make the mob spawner. Okay. So what we need to do is we need to make a Ba a small box. Then we need to get the line tool. We need to go. We need to zoom in. We need to go like. Nope, no, nope, that is too thick. 
I'm gonna do please, thank you. Then I'm gonna need to... Whoa! Okay, maybe... Let's go with the thinnest. Because that's still a pretty big brush. Probably just because we're zoomed in so much. So we're going to make like a hashtag shape. Don't know why it does that, but okay. I'm actually going to add... Nope. Let's remove two lines. There we go. And then let's add a line there. And a line there. Nope. Gosh dang, I keep my, I have an idea here. Let's straighten up. So let's put that. Straighten up. So let's put that. I think that looks good enough. Let's actually add another one here. It's not. It's not gonna really be hashtag. Perfect. So now we have to add another sprite. Where we get a orange rectangle, and we add that look there. Grab this. And then we have to resize. Oh, sorry about that. So it's decently small. Yeah, I would say that's good enough. Then let's get. Let's actually get this. Let's do this. Duplicate it. Duplicate these two. Uh, oops. And I want to duplicate these two to be over here. I'm actually going to go with this and remove that one. Then I'm going to use this duplicate tool. I'm actually liking this duplicate tool. didn't think I would use it as much as I am. Okay, we're actually gonna use a select tool and we're gonna move it because we want it much closer together. Remove this over. Now, what? Why did it go down there? Uh oh. Okay, we're gonna have to do some editing. There we go. Then we're gonna need to select that and go with that. Then we're gonna use the rectangle and we're gonna do it like this. Nope. That's here. Let's move it over. Let's remove that, I guess. Okay. Remove that. Remove that. Let's start with a body, apparently, because I'm really bad at making a blaze, clearly. Okay. Now we can resize it. So I'm going to make it small, even smaller. Even smaller. Yeah, it's, that looks good for a blaze. And let's go, let's zoom in. Go to the side, apparently. Okay, here it is. Let's grab the rectangle tool. And we're going to add, like, the little rod thingies around them. Doesn't really matter what size they are. Okay, then I'm going to get some eyes. Of course, this isn't... I'm just going to make it like that. Perfect. That goes like that. Okay. I would say that's a pretty good size. I'm going to name this sprite. I'm going to name this Blaze. Okay, and then n now I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna take this, zoom out. No, no, not zoom in. Zoom out. I'm gonna duplicate. Then I'm gonna add a. I'm adding text that will say, "A little while later," because we'll be doing some coding later. That will say stuff. Okay, then they're going to head back, and they're going to come out here again. 
They're gonna, okay. Now we need to make an Enderman. So let's take this purple that we actually already have. Take the rectangle tool. Let's see what size we should make the leg. Uh, actually, I think that's a perfect size. So if I just duplicate this over here, because they're a little taller, so we're gonna, oops, no, don't worry about that. Get the rectangle tool again. And we're gonna go like that. Okay, never mind. Let's make this smaller. Okay, smaller. Smaller. Actually, I think that's a little too small. Yeah, that's way too small. Uh, even bigger. Yeah, that looks good for an enderman. So then let's get the rectangle tool. And we'll expand his head. Good. Let's take the line tool. Make it a little wider. Wider. Let's give him some arms. Some lengthy arms. Then we're going to add... Oh, wait, no. No, remove that. Go within with the rectangle tool. Zoom in. Go down. Over. Then we're going to go with this. We're going to go like that. And we're going to go like that. So we're going to expand the eye a little bit. Good. And then I'm going to name this guy Enderman. I'm actually going to use this costume thing over here, and I'm going to give it, give this one name, uh, Passive, and this one is going to be called Angry, because now we're using the costume thing, and we're also going to have to use that for one of us, don't know which one it is yet, and then with the Angry, I'm going to go like this, I'm going to raise his head up up like that then using the select tool open up a mouth perfect passive aggressive passive aggressive passive aggressive okay then I'm gonna go back to backdrops backdrops I'm gonna duplicate this one I'm gonna say yeah, first off, I'm going to zoom back out, get some text, yep, make it black, uh, and it's going to say, it's going to say, uh, after collect, after killing a few endermen, dot, 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 of course, going to add some more code later, then, we're going to need a whole new backdrop, so let's duplicate this. We're going to need this, and we're going to totally just cut everything out. Like this. We're going to need a select tool, and we're going to go like... We're going to go like that. I don't know why I'm doing this. I could easily just go like bam. Bam. Can I fill the yellow, please? Oh, did my scratch totally freeze? Apparently my scratch froze. We're doing a lot of work today. Oh, okay, there we go. So, yeah, this is going to be a long episode. Actually, speaking of that, I'm going to end it here. See you guys later. Bye.